Are serving, it's the Netherlands in orange receiving. This is the second game of the day from the FIVB World Grand Prix Finals on match day three. <laughs> Shooting, stakes her case straight away. Nice cut, hitting that outside the body line from four to four. And China off and running. Chung Chang Ling with the serve. Oh, good from Min Lee. It's a bit tight, but a good joust. China have to go again. Zhu Ting has to go block out. Well covered by Bausch. Black tries to get it off the hands without success. Zhu Ting once more. Desperate attempt here for the Netherlands. They still can't find a way of putting the ball on the floor, though, and getting the point. They might do now. <laughs> Ding Xia makes the dig. Xu Ting being asked to do something, but against three blockers, it's a continuation hit. Oh, what a rally this is. Well, Christine has a go, unsuccessfully. Xu Ting asked again. And she's done it this time, off the hands and away. The crowd go crazy. 2-0 China. Ball not working. So an unforced error from China. First point on the board for the Netherlands. China finding it a little bit more difficult now to stop the Netherlands. Bausch makes sure it goes down. Barely in with the serve. Nice work from Black getting through the block. Getting past Xu Ting and Gao Yi. Oh, that's a great swing actually down the line past Xu Ting. That was wonderful. And the end will serve again. Scores a level. <laughs> Barely a run up from Xu Ting. Fortunately for her, putting it too long. Netherlands now in front. Good out. Well, space was cleared pretty quickly to allow Chung Chang Ning to have the swing on the pipe. Shah going back to the serving line. Gong Shang Yu coming in to the front row for China. Three attacking options for them. Excellent isolation work by the Netherlands. Everybody running their routes and pinning their opposite numbers, their opposite blockers. So a one on one in the middle. And the Netherlands get the ball down.
shooting seems quite casual. Doesn't have a big runner. Excellent dig from Lin Lee. was going the wrong way. So De Graal puts it down. Moving her feet, didn't get stable. So China have the point. Nothing separating the teams at the moment, apart from the net. blocking that's always going to be a bit tricky for Marit Balkestein up against Yuan Xinyue she got so high and so far across the net Xinyue's stats are spiking at 317 blocking at 311 on a net that is 224 high looking for touches it's not going to happen there might be a challenge Indeed there is, that was hit pretty quickly, wasn't it? Well, we're not quite going to have a technical, we have a challenge first, which means actually we could be 7-6, uh, or 7 all, I should say, instead of 8-6 um, if the challenge is successful for the Netherlands. For those of you that might be new, not sure, we get a look at the replay, that's not the challenge system replay. But I think we can quite clearly see as the official review then goes over the top of that, there was no touch. Coaches have two challenges per set. And they can challenge for a block touch, net touch, antenna touch, ball in, ball out, football. And also the four touches as well, where the ball goes in the net and deemed not to hit the block. Morrison talking about the three blockers and the communication so that if three if the outside blocker joins in the middle and the other outside that the back row know as they need to shift around to cover the space that's been left by the third blocker. That's what Mr. Morrison is talking about. It's China with the serve. Gao Yi with the ball. So I think isn't putting the Netherlands under any pressure at the moment. They're able to run their offence. They're siding out nicely. De Kraft now back to serve. No Lonica Sluchis for the Netherlands, although she is here with the squad. But not in the starting line, not in the uh, team. Once more. Then <laughs> Shinue getting up, facing five, turning back towards one and bringing the hammer. <laughs> Good 
good up, but it won't come back into play. And another tidy side out from the Netherlands. Excellent ball in from Lin Lee. Good covering by Zhu Ting. Oh dear, a little bit of confusion between backcourt player and frontcourt player. And an unforced error from the Netherlands. Let's China off the hook. Gong Shang Yu wanted to have a swing, but Yuan Xin Yue was in the way. Tracking, still unable to stop it. Balkerstein now for the Netherlands. Oh, no double given. Doesn't matter, doesn't come over. Four touches it is. The setters always get some leniency. And whilst one team may not agree or get a little bit upset, if it's on their side, they're the last to say anything in those situations. And this is good play from the Netherlands, not overall by the occasion, not worried by the fact it's a capacity crowd here and they're up against the Olympic champions. They have the lead and they have a cushion. to the rescue. Oh, brilliant from Ding Xia. And a nice finish from Bausch, the Netherlands taking the point. An excellent effort from Ding Xia to keep that ball from hitting the floor, getting a hand underneath it. Elien. Good serve, right across onto Xu Ting, didn't like that. one that Zhu Ting didn't like. Well, the errors are beginning to cost China. Good lead from Celeste Black. And it's China that called the timeout.
That's a wonderful block from Xu Ting. Up and right across, getting her hands as close to the ball as possible. And not giving any room for Black to go past her. Clever disguise by Zhu Ting. And the roll shot just over the top. Ball hitting the floor before Dykeman can get there. That flat serve from Ting Xia which was passed just about by Bulkerstein. Black is put down. Oh, fabulous commit blocking from Gao Yi. And for being a couple back, it's now all square. was another block, three in a row, a triple for China to take the lead in the technical timeout. The Netherlands find their way through. China are wise to the B quick, that shoot ball. They're posting their middle blockers out there. Slightly different lineup for China. Zhu Ting, who goes back to serve now, traditionally you've got the setter coming from position one with the with Zhu Ting would be in front of her back receiving. But they stack Zhu Ting over on the other side, which means the setter Ting Xia can come right up to the net, pretty much, which they did, and keeps Zhu Ting able to hit on that wide side. Oh, clever play. The block out. Xiong Chang Ning. With an exceptionally good shot. It's a team to serve again. Dutch is 
is doing well to find the gaps in the block. Dalderup's come in and replaced Celeste Plack. Dalderup lining up to Kralf superbly well. And now they're back level again. Point for China. It's a great cut to the line, beating Scoot. Not sure she was ready for that. It was a little bit too tight to the net. Ding Xia not getting the best of control on the ball. In other words, not in the right position to get it all the way for Zhu Ting to have that swing. And now it's China scrambling. Xiong Changning with a continuation hit. Balkestein looks for block out and gets it. So close to Yuan Xinyue. Difficult for Ding Xia to go after that one. Ball in from Zhu Ting under pressure from that serve. Well, China showing they've got firepower in every department. Opposites are working well, both the outside hitters are working well. Again, that's a lovely shot. Be able to turn that ball to the line, keeping the body posture going cross court. The shoulder will work, and off the hands also works. Changes for China. Back on to court. Comes Ding Xia and off goes Li Jing. Very nicely done. Ding Xia. Going behind on that C quick to Yuan Xunye. Xiong Chang Ning. Netherlands chasing Plaque. 
Gets dug by Zhu Ting, but it'll be free ball for the Netherlands. Oh, good up from Lin, Lin Ying, but unfortunately, or Lin Lee, but unfortunately, no one else can get hold of it. And Black has come back into court now for Dalbarok doing the business for her team. See how hard that Lin Lee fought to keep her shoulders facing back towards the net. Black looking for hands. Jamie Morrison having a quick look at Black, who's not giving anything back. There might be a challenge coming, just for the sake of not calling a timeout. Looking to see whether this ball hit the block. No more challenges left for the Netherlands. A timeout though, still available. China two away from taking the opening set. Oh, what a serve. That serve was really difficult. It looked as if it was going to hit the net, but it was on a terribly difficult trajectory, just flat. Not even clipping the net in the end. And an ace serve for China gives them set point. The Netherlands have called the timeout. Tough serve. But a good block out from Anne Bausch. But China had two chances from side eight. Now they only have one chance. Excellent serve from the Netherlands. Yelian has been causing problems throughout this set when they're serving, and now China call the timeout. deliver a serve to reduce China's hitting options. The answer's no, but they have slowed down Zhu Ting. Well, it's a huge block from Ting Sha and Gao Yu. And China take the first set, 25-23, and lead 1-0.
Second set underway, Netherlands with the serve. No changes of personnel for either side. One thing that Juting does, no one else seems to do, is she doesn't really get outside the three meter line with her approach, and sometimes it's just a two step approach. It's just ball spring in her legs. Billion getting too tight to the net, not giving herself the opportunity to have a swing through the ball. If she had a done, she would have been in danger of hitting the net. And that has just stopped. You can see as she had to stop that ball with her hand almost and didn't get any of the spin she needed to get it down in time. And now Yuan Xin Yue puts it into play. The ball had gone past Scout. And uh, Laura Dykema looking at her and saying, you should be playing it. Well, it's gone past her. How can she play it? Bausch, maybe. Dykema, definitely. Good lead by Pack and Bausch. will serve. China up by two already in this set. Make it three. Seen that quite a bit in this uh, this tournament so far. Players seeing the ball coming at them and they look to be in picture-perfect position and just let the ball hit them. And if it's a jump serve, it's got weight, power and spin, it's got energy in it, then some of that's okay. They just need to hold that position but then move to the ball. Again, Bauch that time moving away from the ball. That's a little bit tight. Oh, clever from Celeste Black. Just kept her arm straight, held it in there on the joust. Uh, China jumped a little bit too early, so side out achieved. Well, it's an interesting, again, with this lineup that China have, I think Xia would normally be down at one with Zhu Ting in front of her coming around. But they've changed it, so Zhu Ting is now at, uh, at two. The middle block is right next to her, and the opposite player is over at four. And they're just kind of shuffling around a bit, but there's almost nowhere for the opposite to go. It's just an effort to get Zhu Ting to hit through four, but it's not working. They really are struggling on this rotation at the moment, China. Doesn't look comfortable at all for them. You've got the opposite player passing. Xu Ting is not passing. Ding Xia is definitely out of rotation at the moment. She does like to creep past where she should be. But again, this is all about getting Xu Ting the ball against three blockers. Not sure that it's being very effective for them, although they might have a better opportunity now which they have done with the opposite player, Dong Xiang Yu, hitting through two, but inside out, it's difficult for her to get across over that way. The USA were experimenting with that last season, last year, and they're running their opposite player on a 
a slide all the way round, which was very effective. The middle blocker coming on the slide as well. It was a, that's a nice play, isn't it? Great block from Xiong Chang Ning. So let's plan again, hitting it hard and being successful. But not from the serving line. by two at the technical timeout. Gao Yi for China. <laughs> Off the hands and away. It was Xiong Chen Ning the ball came off of. Good up from Scout. Nobody reacting quickly enough that time. That was a tricky one, wasn't it? Off the block and inside the three metre line. Long way for Lin, Lin Lee to come after the ball. He almost, she almost got there. Excellent refereeing from Patty Rolf, just waiting. It wasn't clearly obvious as to whether that come off the block or not, but just a couple of seconds to check the reactions and you should then exactly what had happened. <laughs> well, just as they did in the first set, the Netherlands giving a good account of themselves, but as is so often the case when you have teams in this situation, the better team are the team that are able to just to force the couple of points they need towards the end of the set. It's up to the Netherlands to try and get themselves ahead as early as possible in the set and hold on to it. China are normally very frugal with their errors. Elian trying to get into the area, but not getting her hands back around to get across the net, so she opened up the angle as a result of that cross-court. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
little bit too quick for Balkastein. Nice shooting, just saying to Yuan Xinyue, I got it. See, that was an excellent swing from Zhu Ting. And now Dal the Rock's coming in, the youngster. Replacing Bausch. for China, missing their serve on more than one occasion. was a good serve it needed a long look from the lines judge the thing is now it's it's a strange situation we have we have the challenge system we have Hawkeye and those cameras look directly down the line that means the lines judges are now offset from the line and they're not getting a true view of where they used to have when they were looking down the line so it kind of justifies having Hawkeye because you need it for those decision situations, whereas if it wasn't there, the line judge would have been looking down the line anyway. So a good challenge from the Netherlands. Alkersteen's on to it. Oh, they were doubling up. On Gao Yi, not the best of setting decisions by Din Xia. She was front court, comes inside. Three blockers going in. That ball behind on the 10 would have been a free swing. Excellent. better the Netherlands fighting very hard getting the ball into transition <laughs> work from Balkenstein It seems China don't, I don't say they don't like to, they just don't seem to be doing it very often, and that's running the ball on the right-hand side in the back row on 10. This time the pipe works. That's Ding Xiao with the serve. She had a run of serves last time. Capable of putting the pressure on. That's a good ball in from Dalderop. And she just about got enough on that as well to see the Netherlands get the side out. When needed, Zhu Ting. Yeah. 
We are out of system play, which is what was the situation that Plaque find herself in. And she didn't commit to what she needed to do. Unforced error, and it's China who have the lead at the second technical timeout. then level up again. Brilliant from Dalderop. Netherlands hanging into the rally, creating the opportunity. Dalderop taking it. be coming back a ball that looked to be going long played by Lin Lin and Lin Lee and it's an ace serve for Celeste Black Netherlands two in front so changes for China on comes Liu Xiaotong to go through the outside and Zhong Changling going out well on the right side going over the top and the Dutch block and it's Gao Yi to serve and somehow China caught out by that Almost caught the Netherlands out as well. Dowdorf did well to get a hand onto the ball. Yes, That's what Young Xiao Xiang Yu brings to the party. She can go line or she can go cross court with impunity. She'll be serving. <laughs> Not the best of introductions for Liu Xiaotong. First swing is an error. Jasper coming in to serve. 
Marit Jasper. Plays in Germany for VFB Suhl. Oh, great serve. Brilliant introduction. China call the timeout. again. Better from Liu Xiaotong. China haven't been able to run much of their middle, which was a formidable weapon against Brazil. In this match so far, Yuan Xin Yue and Gao Yi have been reduced to more, more or less blocking roles. Double substitution trying to be run by China at too late. Players weren't paying attention. Oh, some awesome defence by the Netherlands. And they're looking for touches. They're going to challenge a touch. Oh, it did, didn't it? Caught Digma. It will be. It will be China's ball. Indeed, a touch it was. No escaping Hawkeye. Here's Xiao Tong with the first serve of the match. China one behind. Nice serve, no middle coming. Balkestein doesn't find the baseline, but it goes off the block, does it? And uh, Ding Xiasek, yeah, sorry, did touch it. Now again. Trying to force that ball to Xu Ting. When Yan Xinyue would have had probably just one on one against Balkestein. And now the double change. And in comes Jiao Lin Yu to set. And the opposite slot is Tian Xing Wen. Setting by uh, Diao Linwu. Yuan Xinyue back to the serving line. One side out needed for set point for the Netherlands. That's too long. Wouldn't want to come down in time. Set point it is now for the Netherlands and three opportunities. One from serve and two from side out if required. Good position to be in. That was something else from Xu Ting. Oh, 
ball for the Netherlands. Clever play from Zhuting, and the second set point is saved. And no doubt there'll be a timeout coming. Delicate touch from Zhuting. Jumwing once again. Daldrop's done it. And the Netherlands take the second set, 25-23, to level this match at one set all. on court she'll be serving Dalderop keeping her place on court for the Netherlands Shooting over the top and the ball is in Liao Xiaotong once again Serve of a lovely pass. Although Barkestein not able to have a swing. Kyung <laughs> Xiang Yu is. A rare swing on the right side from the back row. Very well executed. A serve, Liu Xiaotong, what a beauty that is. Right at Balkestein. Didn't move her legs in time. Great save. But all to no avail. 
having to give a free ball back over. Netherlands make sure that they put it on the floor. Wonderful chase, though, by Lin Lee and Zhu Ting for China, making the Netherlands work a little bit harder for their point. And now Barkerstein with the serve. Seven points so far for Bellien, who uh, has the player put the ball down. And it's Yuan Xinyue who puts the ball down for China. with that being even higher for it. <laughs> China are starting to control this set now. They're getting a better handle on the passing and Gong Xiang Yu with no trouble to find the line Scoot going backwards slightly didn't get herself in a good neutral position and Xin Yue going from five this time straight down the line or after Balkestein she's looking at the coach and getting serving instructions as she goes on The ball went into the net, but it caught part of some of the block. As you can see, it hit belly in and then went into the net. So, play on, but China unable to recover it. Belly in now with the serve. Good lead from China. Just too inconsistent, or well, just inconsistent would be the word for Celeste Black. When she gets it right, she's brilliant. Oh, that was nearly costly for China. And Xu Ting makes up for it. The ball coming in off of a very good serve from Ting Xia, and nobody ready for it at the net and Xu Ting finds the opposite corner with the technical timeout it's a, a very big lead for China Excellent ball in from Balkestein. A little bit of luck, but they'll take it as the ball just clips the top of the net. But the option to go to the middle was available because of the pass from Balkestein. That is a wonderful serve from Celeste Black. She may be inconsistent. She makes up for that last error she had by getting an ace serve. It's another good serve. Although De Krauf wasn't ready to have a swing, a little bit too close to the net. And then she's shut down by Zhu Ting. 
And the chance for the Netherlands goes. A monster block from Zhu Ting. Jay has been uh, coming in and going out. Wong Ming Jay acting as the uh, Libro to play defence, and then Lin Lee is acting as the Libro for passing and transition play for China. Very nicely done by Dalderop. Down the rock, just 18 years of age. And this is all new territory for her playing in a World Grand Prix finals. Never done that before. You wouldn't know it to look at her, would you? Nice work from Zikma shutting down Li Xiaotong. Netherlands are getting back into the set. That's a brilliant pickup from Dalderop. China have to go again. That was a little bit too low. And now it could be the Netherlands. But they have to volley back over. That will drift all the way out of play. And she declares not allowed to do that. It's come back through the antenna. So China take the point. They lead by two. All two metres and one of Yuan Xinyue being used to great effect. Well worked by Scoot. It's going to be a foot fault by Celeste Plack. Uh, she's towed the three metre line. She's a back row player and has to take off from behind it. Step on it or over it, it's a fault. A little bit like a throw, a little bit like 80s volleyball. But it's China who take the point. Xiaotong with the jump serve. A bit 
Big swing from Black, but it doesn't find the baseline. Didn't catch any hands either. That'll go down as an unforced error from her. I'll be interested to see her plus-minus ratio at the moment, whether she's in plus points or she's in minus points. Plus point for that, but with that previous swing, a minus, cancelling it out. So far, she's 32% efficient with her attack points. Very nice, and Xia goes over on the second ball. Tricky jump float serve that she has. Yu <laughs> Xiaotong keeps it in play. Oh, brilliant. Dowdrop gets it cross court. And no Libro in at five. It was a good effort from Yun Xinyue to get to it, but she gets beaten. Belly end to serve. to the second technical timeout and it's China leading by four points. She's now out of the play. Dalderop is slowed down. Then Lee will put this to Zhu Ting. Brilliant chase from Jake Matt. And Dalderop finds a way through. Block closing too late. and away from Xu Ting. China are keeping themselves far enough away from the Netherlands at the moment. Xu Ting with the serve. Powerful hit from Celeste Black. Oh, that'll stay. No, not quite. Gao Yi suddenly finding the ball upon her. Zhao 
crowds are up with the serve. Xiao Tong doing the business. looking for fingers, did she get them? Yuan Xinyue made the touch. Lovely speed from Gong Xiang Yu. It's almost like she's running up an invisible ladder. Stands at the top. Bang. Hits the ball down. Taking up an invisible escalator, more like. Gong Xiang Yu with the serve. Shooting playing six, but more like playing target one. Yeah, Lyon caught in the middle. And ball off a block and away. Comfortably, Balkenstein now to serve. It's not Balkenstein. Dykeman with the serve. Balkenstein is in the front row with Belly in. And we've got a rotation error between ten and one. Fantastic spot from the ref. Ding Xia and Yuan Xinyue thought they were at three and uh, four. Rather two and four, so trying to have their side out. That's more like it from them. Good disguise. Which should ting on the pipe. Heat on that from Black to see it go wider. Netherlands sticking in here, which might just get under the nails of the Chinese team. It's Pakistan to serve. Oh, lovely. Great skills from Gong Sheng Yu. Able to control the ball. Just find a space on court. Get the side out. Blocking substitution. As uh, up to court comes Wang Yuan Yuan. He thought Wang Yang was going to come in for Ding Xia, and then you had three really tall blockers in the front row. But as it is, Wang Yang is going to stay in. It's more or less a direct replacement for Gao Yi. There's one middle blocker for another. Good art. That's a brilliant watch. And a brilliant finish. Credit Gong Sheng Yu with that play. Creeping round and digging a ball near the net. And then it's Xu Ting doing what she does best. Gong Xia will serve.
It looks like unforced error, possibly. There's going to be a challenge coming. It may well have gone off of the Chinese block. Very difficult to see in real time. Is there a touch? I think there is. The two fingers of uh, Gong Shan Yu. bring the Netherlands level. Oh, it was a good serve, but well passed, actually. Options. Shooting is dug. So to Plaque. Alkestein dealing with Shooting. Oh, that'll be a double touch against Zegma. Unfortunately for her, as that rally went on, more and more perspiration got on the ball. Alkestein was already wanting to change her top halfway through the last set. She's all so hot and sweaty, and there's some perspiration on the floor that needs clearing up. Liu <laughs> Xiaotong goes out, and Xiong Cheng Ning comes back in. Xu Ting with the serve, China two away, taking the set and leading 2-1. <laughs> Excellent. Tauderop finding a way through. It looks like Liu Xiaotong's coming back in. It was a blocking substitution for China that didn't work. Tauderop with the serve. Dowderop's got a 62% efficiency at the moment with her attacking and 11 points, so 12 points she's got. Double that of Celeste Black, you can forgive the serving error, but it does mean that it's set point for China. Timeout called by the Netherlands. Do nicely. Yuan Xinyue. Get her hands above the net standing. Didn't have them above the net. Best chance now for China to get the side out to take the set. Otherwise, 24 all, and we keep going until someone gets too clear. Jasper came on in the last set and scored an ace. Nice for her team, and she could do that now. That's not going to happen. China take the set 25 23. And here at the Olympic Center in Nanjing, they lead by two sets to one.
Away we go with the fourth set. Zhu Ting back in action straight away with a swing through the outside. Net touch against China. Zhu Ting probably. Oh, it's quite tight. It's a good shot from Celeste Black. Net touch against the Netherlands. Bow saying she didn't. Dowder up saying she didn't. We may have a challenge if they can get it done in time. Challenge it is. Was there a net touch? Yes, there was. And despite the fact that uh, De Kral saying she didn't, it was her leg touched it. But it was well, on the knee pad. Maybe she didn't feel it. She was convinced she hadn't. The touch against Xu Ting, a bit scrappy at the moment for China. China getting a little bit more comfortable with that play where they have the they have Zhu Ting over on the stacking on the other side, able to run the opposite on a half ball in the middle. And that's a wonderful block. Wong Yuan Yuan who has stayed in for this fourth set. Showing why. Down the rock to serve. Was all that uh, Dikma could do. She was a little bit too far forward, having to scramble backwards to play the ball. No oh, one paying attention. Creeping in on both sides of the net. 
Hawks and Evelyn's with the lead. And Liu Xiaotong gets it through the block. As things currently stand in this group with Brazil, who had beaten the Netherlands 3 2. With China now leading 2-1, the Netherlands have to win this set. They have to win 3-2. And if they were to do that, then they would go through in second place and Brazil would be out. China guaranteed to go through in top spot regardless now. Oh! Just one amazing dig after another. And again. And that's off the hands and away. Balkestein gets the point for the Netherlands. They are working their socks off. That was fantastic. You can take your pick from any of the digs. And a 30-second rally, bar point four. That was energy sapping. As Balkestein at the net, Dietma with the serve. Plack and Bellian, the other two front court players at the moment for the Netherlands. So three options now for Dietma. Balkestein at one on one, that's good reactions from Yuan Xinyue. And Plack just again trying to burst the ball. And we hit the technical timeout. It's the Netherlands leading by two. the runner point so far Netherlands with two from the serving line China just with the one at this point what Jamie Morrison is looking for. Warriors are what are required on court. The mismatch exploited. No matter how high Bellion tried to go, she couldn't get anywhere near Yuan Xinyue. And she puts down the overpass. Oh, that would have been special. unlucky from China not having the, the foot skills to bring it back through the antenna Markstein with the serve Netherlands keeping themselves two in front and there's a slight technical issue now the on-court mic has just been hit that needs to be rectified it's hanging down and uh, might be a bit dangerous I'll get somebody onto that shortly UN with the serve. That's off the hands and away from Bellier.
Oh, that's unlucky. How often do you see that player going in, going with the hand that they play volleyball with, they hit with? Bellien, maybe, if this had been with her left hand, she'd have got better control on the ball. Would have brought it back to her teammates. Down drop, block out. Netherlands keeping that two-point advantage. Frustrating China at the moment. That will do very nicely. A serve for the Netherlands. They are keeping China quiet, they're keeping the crowd quiet. Just sneaking the odd point here and there. Xu Ting somehow gets that past the block. Xu Ting now 21 points, only 47% efficient. I have a double that number of swings. De Krauf with her 10 points is 62% efficient. The Netherlands good for their three point lead at the moment. It could be four. It's an excellent chase. Good up from Scout. Parkerstein has to go free ball. Three front court options, although that's not the best pass in. And now the Netherlands come again. And Plack puts it down. That's a four point lead now for the Netherlands. China will be worrying. And China called the timeout. serve as well, pressure for China again. But Mews Xiao Tong gets them out of trouble. Wang Yang Yuan with the serve. a chance. Wang Yuan Yuan will be uh, disappointed she didn't dig that. Netherlands won't be. Oh, wonderful. Dowderot. Ghosting through the middle, and this is an impressive lead now for the Netherlands in this fourth set. They lead by five at the second technical timeout.
that was a chance. Dowdrop and Platt getting their lines wrong. And trying to get the side out. Lovely blocking from Bellien. Xian Qingwan comes in in the opposite slot in the front row and Diao Lin Yu to serve. She'll be setting. We're just getting a serving target from head coach Morrison. Or after Zhu Ting. Leo Xiaotong gets the side out. Liu Xiaotong, seven points, 55% efficient. Left arm and left side doesn't work. It's not really technically how you see a lot of players attack the ball. Doesn't throw both of her arms right up in the air. Just lost a little bit of height with that attack. So Liu Xiaotong serves again. Excellent ball in from Scout. Another chance. And that's better from Black, but good digging from Liu Xiaotong. Oh, so unlucky for the Netherlands. What a wonderful point for China, giving the crowd something to shout about. That needed to be the left hand, didn't it, from Black? Play Bellien, a middle passing hitter. Found brilliantly by Tiao Lin Yu. That contact height. No block getting nearer. Yuan Xin Yue's serving has gone off the ball a little bit. It was very effective at the beginning of the game. And that's what the Netherlands are able to do from the serve. Just run the middle themselves. Chang Wing. Oh, brilliant. Dowder up. 
over the top. That was very impressive. Even head coach Jamie Morris talked to his assistant saying, well, she was over the top. Good serve from Plack. Free ball for the Netherlands, two front court attackers. Tyke was having a little look to see whether she could go on two, and it's straight to Dalderop. Yeah, that's no trouble putting it down. Sixty-eight percent efficient now. Down the She's got sixteen points in the match so far. Double substitution has been reversed. Gong Shang Yu is in. Ding Xia is in. Ting gets the side out, but China with three back. And Netherlands only needing four. It's not looking good for them. It's looking very good for the Netherlands at the moment. And it's looking even better now for the Netherlands. Daldrop once again. Be a change. Stoltenberg coming in as a direct replacement for Dijkman. One set for another, but extra height at the net. Good work from Plack. It's going to have to go again. Oh, I was going with a roll on that, not try to take the block on. Stoltenberg comes off, take me back in. Unforced error from China. Netherlands surely now will go on and take this set. Just two points required. They need to focus on anything but the scoreboard at the moment. Robin de Kraft comes out and in goes Jasper. Marek Jasper with the serve. Well left, that was a, a close one. <laughs> Gong Xiang Yu will serve. Netherlands siding out for set point. Don't even have to do that. It's given to them. Dijkma will serve. Barely in Barkerstein, Plack in the front row. Only two front row attackers for China. Tin Shah's at four. Scoop keeps it in play. Su Ting is shut down, and that's it. The Netherlands take the set 25 20. It's two all, and that means we're heading into a decider. Confirmation of the scores, 25-23, 25-23, 25-23, and a change in the fourth, 25-20. Well, twice now, 
two games in a row, Netherlands have got and taken a team to the fifth set. And it was Brazil on match day two. It's China here who is going to take the deciding set. Here are the highlights. And it's all on the Netherlands here. If they can force this win, if they can get over the line, they'll be into the semi finals. It's out of Brazil's hands. China are through, top of the group, regardless. But can the Netherlands get themselves the win that they need to stay in this tournament? And that would send a message out as well. If they could beat China, they'd be playing Serbia in the semi-finals. China will be playing Italy. Away we go with the fifth set. Yao Xiaotong with the serve. And the perfect start for the Netherlands. Yelien through the middle. Zhu Ting gets the side out. That's a great serve. Well, actually, I'm just thinking about this now, and I think it doesn't really matter here because the Netherlands, well, it does matter, isn't it? They lost 3 2, so they only have a point. That means they need to win this for two to get three as Daldrop puts it down because Brazil are sitting on two points at the moment. I thought just for a moment that the uh, Netherlands had two points, they don't. They need these two, they need these two points from a 3-2 victory, all square across the board, 2-2-2-2. Two, 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 two. Back with the serve. Great dig from Lin Lee. And it's a wonderful block. Daldrop getting in, tripling up, and Netherlands taking the lead. Oh, 
Su Ting, once she gets that ball nice and high, she's able to take on the, the block, no matter how many are there. Which means Jackman needs to go as late as possible on it. Shark coming out, direct replacement this, setter for setter for China. And in comes Xiao Lin Yu. Xu Ting fires down the ball and fires up the crowd. Again, over the top of Tikma. That could well be just volleyball 101 at the moment for China. They can just keep doing that and use this mismatch as much as, much as possible while they have the rotations to do it. Jaldrop taking care of that though for the Netherlands. All square again. is outstanding, there's no question of that. But right now it's a good battle, isn't it, between Zhu Ting and Dalderon. <laughs> Nobody deep to chase down the ball off the block. China opened up a two-point margin. Well, they're looking for a net touch and it's been given against the Netherlands. Teichmer saying, yeah, I did touch the net. That's a situation where you can have Gao. Well, I've seen it before, Gao Yi, although she didn't, playing and grabbing the hand of the player and throwing it on the net. And then it is a net touch by the player whose hand touched it. Lovely block out by Robin de Croft. Marit Jasper in. Be the Netherlands ball because the setter is in the back row playing it on the side of the Netherlands. Su Ting saying, Was well, she trying to set it? Well, yes, yeah, she was. And Diao Lin Yu was trying to set it, but she's on the wrong side of the net, and that's well within the rights of Billy N to make that block. crowd and they will firmly believe that they put off Marit Jasper from the serve. 8-6 it is, end change.
after over two hours of play. We are no closer to deciding who is going to win this one. Side out that for the Netherlands. Oh, she's come into the front row for Balkestein, height at the net. Dykeman now captain on court. Could well be paying off. Plack. Brilliant. The substitution working. Bow slowing the ball down. Netherlands getting it into transition. And now we're all square at eight apiece. That's a nice hit from Celeste Plack. Liu <laughs> Xiaotong. Here's Doug, Doug drop it was, getting the dig. That's a brilliant dig from Lin Lee. Liu Xiaotong again having a go, but doesn't find the sideline. Thinking about, was there a touch? Nothing. No touch, not in court, but there might be a challenge coming here for block touch. There is, China are going to challenge. Both teams have two video challenges available. Well, they've just been shown the broadcast replay. Here is the official a review, and it is a touch in the block, and it is China's point. Technology at its finest. Dong Xiang Yu to serve. block for China and now they have a two-point lead is it going the same way for the Netherlands as it did for their match against Brazil not caught the sideline line judge says out they might challenge this as well China should team got a point or will it be Netherlands who have the point quick review says no good one challenge left for China one substitution left. And two timeouts. Balkestein with the serve. Great play, Celeste Black. And the Netherlands have turned it around again. They're back level. And now China call timeout. Celeste Pack looking for the options available now. Wonderful play.
It'll be the captain for the Netherlands with the serve. Net touch by China and Netherlands have the lead. Oh, you've got to be on the edge of your seat if you are supporting the Netherlands right now. This is hard in your mouth moments. Marek Balkenstein again. Good serve. A chance for the Netherlands. Oh, it's off the block, brilliant from Dalderop. The youngster belying her years. Dalderop now 20 points, didn't start this match. 68% efficient. Balkerstein still serving. Been giving it a target by Jamie Morrison. Little change up going to Liu Xiaotong. And there's another chance here for the Netherlands. Daldrop again. That's going to go wide. And the Netherlands now lead by three. And they're two away from a place in the semi finals. That close. And yet, in the context of a game of volleyball, still far enough away not to be certain of anything. Timeout called by China. None left for them. and for the Netherlands they are on the verge of a sensational victory here no question of that against the Olympic champions against a capacity crowd here in Nanjing Marit Balkenstein serves again match point for the Netherlands block out by Liu Xiaotong but what a position now for the Netherlands to be in. Three chances from side out. Three opportunities to go into the semi-finals. Liu Xiaotong will serve. Going with the jump serve. It's an ace serve. Oh, the drama. Jamie Morrison keeping calm, calling time out. Two opportunities, two match points saved, two chances still for the Netherlands. They will have a swing. It's Dauderop. Oh, she's dug. Zhu Ting puts it down. Another match point saved. One final chance for the Netherlands to do it from side out. Is it now or never? Liu Xiaotong. Ooh! Still in play. Celeste Black. Oh! 
It's hit the floor. And shooting it is who put it on the floor. Goodness me, what a finish to the match. Incredible stuff. Four match points saved by China and look what it means to them. Oh, the atmosphere is electric here at the Olympic Centre. When that ball hit the top of the net, me and 6,000 other people all going, oh, and I'm sure you were at home as well. But well, this is it. The Netherlands need to side out. Is that off the block? They're going to look for a touch. It's not been given, there'll be a challenge. Because that would be some turnaround, wouldn't it? From four match points down to having a match point. Was there a block touch? Oh, yes, there was. Diderop's got the point. We will be having side out, and it will be match point number five for the Netherlands, but they have got to do it the hard way now. Therefore, three chances from side out have gone. Now it has to be one from serve, and it's the same for both teams. Belien goes back, gets herself set. Big front row for the Netherlands. Dalderop, De Krauf and Plack. Can they close down China? Oh, they won't need to. It wouldn't come down. Another match point saved. Yuan Xinyue. Good ball in from Balkastein, down it goes through the middle, De Kral puts it down, it's match point number six. Well, if you're the coach right now, and the coaches for the Netherlands, you are emotionally drained, but still having to hold it together, no doubt. Roars for China, Stoltenberg's come on, added height at the net. But also a setter as well, Dietmar to the bench, Palak with the serve. Ding Xia in trouble, but Xu Ting gets her out of trouble. Ding Xia gave that everything to get it out wide, to get it to her captain, and her captain just went over the top and put it down. The substitution's been reversed. Dykema back in. Ding Xia now with the serve, and it's China have moved into a tough series of rotations as far as the Netherlands are concerned. Now they have three front row attackers. That's a top serve. Dalderop keeping her cool, but it's dug by China. Zhu Ting! Oh, yes! Zhu Ting over the top of three blockers. And China now have their first match point. Straight over the top of Sigma. A cruel blow for the Netherlands. Delight for China and the Chinese fans. Ding Xia to serve again. The crowd on their feet. They're going to have a swing for it. Shooting! And it's all over. China! Break Netherlands' hearts! Xu Ting putting the ball down. China taking the match by three sets to two. Unbelievable scenes here.